So interesting fact about bypass, coronary artery bypass, commonly known as bypass surgery, is that it's a not a permanent cure. And the most commonly used bypass pipe has a surprisingly high failure rate. But yes, my friends. The saphenous vein, thinking from the patient's leg, of course, has been a workhorse for bypass past surgery for decades. However, veins are not designed, nor designed by God, the high pressure environment of the arterial system. As a result, about half of all saphenous vein grafts are significantly decreased of comp or even completely blocked within several years, no, 10 years of the surgery. So this is a shocking because patients, even some, even some uh, doctors, non-specialist clinicians, okay, often view this massive open heart operation as a permanent fix. In reality, the vein grafts develop their own aggressive form of atherosclerosis called graft disease. This is why the internal mammary artery, an, an artery from inside of the chest wall, is the gold standard now. It's the, uh, it's the gold standard graft. It's, it's an artery built for a uh, high pressure and over 90 percent them are still open 10 years later so my beloveds the ultimate shock is that the realization that the surgery is a brilliant but temporarily replimbing job cabbage doesn't stop the main pathological process what is the main pathological process atherosclerosis no i had explained it this whole chain so atherosclerosis which will tirelessly attack new transplants if the patient doesn't radically change his lifestyle, completely change his lifestyle. So atherosclerosis is not appendicitis. It is the price paid for a healthy lifestyle. That is atherosclerosis. It's a price paid for your unhealthy lifestyle. So lectures concerning cabbage are now in my telegram channel Dr. Y. Telegram, private channel. Bye-bye.